All right, so welcome to my channel. And in case you're new, I try vegan treats, snacks, eats, and a lot of artisanal stuff. And today we have Hail Mary. And I don't believe this company is fully raw, but it is definitely vegan. And I would imagine it's kind of paleo, but I'm not sure. And I've had their products before and they're really good. So let's start. Um, a lot of these come in these, um, when you open them up, like this Meyer Lemon, I'll show you. Here's the one. Get it open. So first we're gonna try the Meyer Lemon. These come in here, but I already took them out, so you know, for time saving. And I've already tried one of each. And so these, the little um, cups, they come two to a package. So first we're gonna try the Meyer Lemon. And it's organic shredded coconut, organic blue agave, organic virgin coconut oil, organic coconut sugar, cashews, almond flour, organic coconut flour, lemon juice, Meyer lemon, concentrated, filtered water, Meyer lemon juice, concentrate, lemon, natural lemon flavor, lemon juice powder, filtered water, orange juice, and sea salt. And, um... The tart zing, zing of creamy Meyer, Meyer lemon ganache and an almond cookie crunt, crust will make your mouth say, pucker up. And they're out, oh, they're in Dallas, Texas. And so we're going to cut it open, show you what it looks like. And again, we're trying the Meyer lemon first. I'm not too crazy about the smell of this one. It doesn't smell bad, but it doesn't taste really fresh. You can smell lemon, but it definitely smells something else. I'm not sure what it is. It doesn't smell bad. I definitely taste lemon. It's creamy. It's a little salty, which I believe is a crust, and um, it's pretty light. Um, it's just kind of there. It's nothing like in your face. So, but it's pretty good. Now we're going to cho uh, try chocolate peanut butter cup. Pull it out. Cut it. These are starting to melt. I left them out a little bit. And that's what the inside looks like. And these, not the main ingredients, almond flour, peanut butter, organic maple syrup, organic virgin coconut oil, cocoa powder, processed organic coconut sugar, cashews, filtered water, vanilla extract, sea salt, um, plant-based version of sweet chocolate perfection, meat salty cream, creamy peanut butter heaven. So I guess this would be like a Reese's peanut butter cup. And it smells like a Reese's peanut butter cup, but with an extra, I'm not sure what that smell is. Mm. It's really dark. The crust. In terms of your Reese's peanut butter cup, but the crust is much more darker, and um, it tastes like organic peanut butter. Like, it's not as sweet as a Reese's peanut butter cup. So, now we're going to try, which one should we try? Which one? Which one? This is one of my favorite ones. It's dark chocolate cup. It's, um... Velvety rich dark chocolate ganache inside a dark chocolate cookie crust will satisfy your craving with double chocolate decadence. Not the main ingredients. And that's probably why I like it. It's simple. Organic maple syrup, it's a lot of sugar, almond flour, dark cocoa powder, organic virgin coconut oil, and sea salt. It's just, wow. I've had this one. Well, I've had them all, but this one I've already had and it's really good.
Yeah. It's really dark. And it's rich. Even though it's dark, the ganache tastes as if it has dairy in it. Even though it doesn't. It's one of my... This one is like top notch. My favorite. Okay. Now we're going to do what? This one. This one... It's good. It's the sweet potato cup. It has organic shredded coconut, organic virgin coconut oil, almond flour, maple syrup, cashews, water, coconut sugar, sweet potato power, sea salt, spices, 2% of spices, organic natural flavor, color, beet juice. Again, sweet potato. This one is extremely buttery. It almost tastes like you're eating butter. If you like butter, you will love it. If you don't like butter, you're not going to like it. You can definitely taste the spices. Clove. I think star anise. I'm not sure what the spices are, but... You do taste pumpkin, but if you like a spicy pumpkin, this is really good. And it's extremely buttery. I'm trying to figure out if it's a crust or the... Yeah, it's a crust. And the crust is just enough salt. That's really good. Now, you see now I just taste a lot of butter. Like I'm eating a stick of, no. It's like I'm eating a stick of butter. Creamy sweet potato and aromatic cinnamon in an almond shortbread cookie crust where spice meets nice. That's why I'm tasting the butter shortbread, shortbread cookie crust. But for vegan, that's not bad because vegans, you know, like, Butter is not an option. Now, you can see these look different. So we get to these now or later? Later. Because I said so. And if you want it to change, leave a comment below and tell me. This is Key Lime. Let's read about it. It is luxurious and tangy lime ganache and an almond cookie crust will transport to you to some place deliciously tropical. So this is the key lime, or I'm sorry, yeah. It definitely smells like key lime. It's not too strong. Mm. This one is better than this one. Key lime is better than the Meyer lemon. The Meyer lemon, I hate to say artificial, but didn't taste really natural. This tastes, this almost tastes like, like someone just made it, like homemade. Today or yesterday. Mmm. Mm, it's really rich and creamy. I mean, it has that that punch. Mmm. The crust has a salt saltiness. This this is this this one, and the dark chocolate ganache. So far is my favorite. Um. So let's continue on. Oh, I did, did I say the ingredients on this one? On this one, the ingredients is coconut, blue agave, coconut oil, coconut sugar, almond flour, cashews, lime juice, lime concentrate, lime oil, um, organic coconut flour, filtered water. Less contains less than two percent of natural flavors. I'm not saying organic sometimes on the ingredients because it's just. You know, time consuming. This is chocolate almond butter. Creamy almond butter and rich dark chocolate ganache melt in your mouth. Sweet, salty perfection. So let's get it open. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Here's the big piece. Very simple ingredients. Organic maple syrup. Almond butter, almond flour, dark chocolate, virgin coconut, olive oil, and sea salt. It smells good, but it... Okay, it smells like fudge. It's the worst one. Do not get this. 
almond butter. What was it? There was another one. Was it peanut butter? This one, really good. Tastes like peanut butter cup, in my opinion, better. This one, don't. It's gross. Really gross. So, it's late at night. I shouldn't be eating this. I've had, again, I've had all these earlier. And so, this is rich dark chocolate espresso ganache cradled in a lish chocolate almond cookie cru crust intoxicating taste from oh so innocent ingredients yeah innocent because there's not that many maple syrup almond flour dark cocoa coconut oil coffee and sea salt so we're gonna just use this plate i guess can't eat a lot of this it has espresso in it it smells really strong like espresso can you smell it can you smell it? <laughs> I can. Mm. You like espresso, not coffee, espresso. You will love this. It's really strong. Mm. The ganache has coffee in it. I mean, okay, the ganache is coffee. It's really creamy and smooth. And in my opinion, tastes fresh. The crust also has espresso in it. And it's not as good as the ganache. My hands are really dirty. I apologize. I should have brought a napkin. Let me napkin real quick here. It's really gross. And if you don't like my hair, then you know what? Subscribe. Like the video, comment, hit the bell icon so I can afford to get a haircut. Seriously. Okay. So, we tried all of them except for these. This is also from Hail, Hair, uh, Harry Mary. Hail Mary. This comes in a three pack. And it doesn't come like this. Those cups. It just literally comes three. Or is it four? No, it's three. Um, this is chocolate chip peanut butter cookie dough. Let's cut it open. If you like cookie dough. Say yes to mind-blowing indulgence anytime, anywhere. Our melt-in-your-mouth cookie dough bites are made with fresh creamy peanut butter, almond flour, and chocolate chips for bursts of added decadence. Plus, they're dehydrated slowly for a super moist, dough-like, fresh taste. So, are they fully raw? I don't know, but if they're not, you know, they're pretty close to it. Almond flour, maple syrup, peanut butter, organic coconut sugar, chocolate chips. The chocolate chips has chocolate liquor, organic cane sugar, cocoa butter, vanilla extract, sea salt, Celtic sea salt. It's not very sweet. I think that's a bad thing. Mm. It tastes like raw cookie dough. Peanut butter. It's good. Not amazing, but it's good. Now, the last one. The last one. Chocolate chip cookie dough. The other one was peanut butter. This is chocolate chip cookie dough, like a regular cookie. Um... See this doesn't smell like cookie dough. It smells like it smells a little bit like cookie dough, but I smell I don't know. It's the same smell that I'm smelling in a lot of these things. I think it's it's coconut. Oh, there's a lot on here. Say yes to mind blowing indulgence anytime anywhere. Our melting mouth bites are made with shredded coconut, virgin coconut oil. Good fats from nuts. Plus, they're dehydrated slowly for super moist, fresh taste. Our clean ingredient bites are ready to eat and satisfy that resistible craving, irresistible craving for old-fashioned chocolate chip cookie dough. No spoon required. Maple syrup, almond flour, shredded coconut, organic chocolate chips. It has all ingredients in that. Uh, I'm getting tired. Chocolate chips has cane sugar, cocoa liquor. Cocoa butter, virgin coconut, 
oil, vanilla, Celtic sea salt. Smell coconut. Mm. The first taste is not good. It's really dry. And then I taste a little bit of cookie dough, but I don't like this one. Mm -mm. So, please let y'all know um, to comment. Tell me what other videos or other products you want me to try. Um, if you want me to get a haircut, I'm going to need you to subscribe so I can afford to get one. Um, what else? Uh, hit the bell icon so you know when my ex next coming videos are coming. Subscribe and comment below, down below, and tell me what food you want me to try. You know, this channel is not just for me, it's for you. You know, I'm sure there's a lot of artisanal vegan snacks or just vegan that are not artisanal that you want to know about and you want to, you know, watch it before you try it. So let me know. Comment below. And until next time.